Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we have super exciting little video for you, at least exciting for us. If you have been around for a while, you know how much we love popsicles, which I understand as a brand, but that kind of thing. We get them in every grocery haul. And now Bomb Pop, which is huge, uh, it's frozen, good, yep. frozen treat brand. They're the ones that are famous for the red, white, and blue. Um, they also, over the last couple of years, have done several collabs with like nerds and some yeah, different things uh, like that. Hawaiian Punch, I believe. But anyway, they came out with a couple of new ones. We're missing one today, but we have a couple that we think are really going to be interesting to try. Yeah, these are Bomb Pop Extremes. Okay. So we've got super sour strawberry on this side. And on my side, we have fire cherry. Fire cherry. So if you look on the packaging here, it says it starts out sour to devour. So it's like sour, super sour, then sour, then sweet. Mm -hmm. And then it's kind of spicy on that one. Yeah. All right, we'll get to that. Let's open it up. And that is what Bomb Pop does really well is multiple flavors. Um, a lot of times the frozen treats that we get don't have multiple flavors in, you know, the whole thing is grape or whatever. When you get an opportunity to get one that has different flavors in it, I really, really like it. The one thing I do have to say about Bomb Pop though, is they sure have gotten a lot smaller. Even better, I've gotten a lot bigger. Well, do you remember when we were on vacation? And <laughs> this is how bad, listen, I am really having a problem. When we went on vacation, I am so addicted to popsicles that I made John go to, I think, multiple gas stations. <laughs> gas stations. Yeah, just to try to find some. And right? finally he found a Bomb Pop. So I, they're my favorite brand forever and ever, Bomb Pop. But it was like this big. It was <laughs> yeah. a much bigger one. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Strawberry is not necessarily my favorite flavor of things. Same. But... Did I say the one that's missing is blue raspberry? I gotta believe that that's a sour one, right? Yes, I would think so. Woo! It's a little sour. It's very sour. All right, I'm gonna try to lick from the middle. It's definitely uh, strawberry though. Mmm. Yeah, it's got a lot of sour in it. All right, I'm going to the end. Oh, the end's so nice. <laughs> mm. What I like is the sour's not overpowering. It's just sour, you know, and then it's slightly less for the red area. What I really want to do is that I'm not <laughs> is the top is too much for me. So I want to eat it like a little kid, like style, but I'm not doing that for a video. It, <laughs> you know? <laughs> I will. <laughs> yeah, John, you go ahead. I'll enjoy it how I want to later. Um, let's move on here. Aha. Fire cherry. So it says, you come over here with your oh, eyes. I think it's, it says hot. Hot and spicy, mild heat, and sweet. Okay. What's the flavor though? Oh, cherry. Cherry, cherry, cherry. Gosh. Fire cherry. I assume they forget. Yeah. Oh, we should say calories. One pop is 40. Which is comparable to... What serving size, though, is three of these. Three! For the serving size, come on. Just make it one. Nobody eats three popsicles in a day besides <laughs> me. Literally. Okay, that was a long struggle to get it out. All right. Okay. Doesn't look as pretty as some of the others, but... <laughs> what is that about? Is it going to be too spicy? Or is it just gonna be like cinnamon? Like if this is just like Red Hots or like Big Red Gum, but like sweet cinnamon, I am all for it. I'm getting a little tingle on my tongue, but nothing that I would say is hot. Mm. 
Yeah, it's not too spicy. Okay, and now I'm going medium. Okay. Yeah, the flavor is good. Uh -huh. I just get like a little, a little kick to it. That's not bad. I'm just a little worried about it, but. Okay. Ooh, the cherry's good. These are really nice. Yeah, I the like them. Cherry is good. Uh huh. Um. I'm surprised because I didn't think that I would like the fire cherry one better than the sour strawberry just because of that like heat component to it. I like spicy stuff, but not necessarily in my <laughs> popsicles. Or... I thought I would. And here's why. Last night I had a handful of those cinnamon, you know, those like jelly cinnamon hearts. Yeah. And I had a couple of those and then immediately ate a popsicle. Mm -hmm. And so I still had like kind of tingly tongue from the cinnamon. And I was like, oh, I bet. Now I know what those popsicles are going to be like. Yeah, that's not bad. Just a little tingle. That's mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. I can just feel it like down the middle of my tongue. If I were only to get one again, it would be this one for sure. I like the cherry flavor better than the strawberry. For I sure. do too. These are great. I would recommend both of them. They're mm -hmm. they're interesting and they're good. And like like we said, we found ours at our local grocery store, Hy-Vee. So I think they're kind of sold everywhere. But we've been looking for them for a couple of weeks. They were hard to find. Uh, come to the comment section and let us know if you're into popsicles like we are. We had a revival. <laughs> yes. We loved popsicles as kids and all of a sudden got back into them, I don't know, late 40s, I would say. <laughs> yeah. We're on like a two or three year yeah, anniversary of being in love with right. popsicles, I think, and not being able to go a day without them. Uh, let us know if you're into popsicles too. Or Bomb Pops, or whatever your favorite frozen treat is. Or us, or the video. Yeah. <laughs> um, wait till the end where YouTube is going to suggest a video to you that they think that you will enjoy that we've made. Hopefully you will. Yeah. Now, if you love frozen treats as much as we do, or Bomb Pops in particular, or us. Or the video. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps our channel grow when you do that. Um, there's we a have little a, cat crawling Yeah, there's a here. cat ready to Loki. destroy everything. Loki. Maybe he'll come pop in. Come here, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come here. Where is he? He's coming. Come on. Loki. Loki. He hasn't, Goodbye, been, Loki. he hasn't been in a video in a while. If you like to see uh, more of Loki, you can check out on our other channel where he does more things. And we just ordered him some things to review for over there on the other channel. But also, hey, I don't want any cat fur on my popsicles. If you want to see more of this little guy, he has a few videos on our other channel and we just ordered him some new things to review. So that'll be fun. You can see more of him over there. But also, he usually makes an appearance in our grocery haul videos. Yes. Yes, he does. So anyway, um, so I guess we'll add Loki to the list. If you love cats or our cat, give us a big thumbs up. We'd all really appreciate it. That's right. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys.